bend the rules other people cannot bend the rules i'm not going to go into semantics when it comes to this shit. um uh, i talked to jan jan earlier she called me she said like she's quitting with the company uh i said is there a possibility you'll be back and she said it's not not as long as ott is there so Fuck as long as know. ott is with the company Th she is not coming back yeah and i said you know if there's a possibility for us to recommend like what would you call the word rip rip -y. no Fuck. repercussions me no rip like where you you repair. try to smooth over it repair. and move forward repair yeah repair it basically and it seemed like it was uh, uh there's a possibility for rip, doing rip. That. <laughs> uh, but not as long as ott was there so i was basically Fuck switzerland giving out chocolate very much holding back a lot and i told her you know what you said is uh it's very very low blow and should never been said and never been done at the same time you getting shot should never been happening if there's some medical bills i hope you bring it up to the company so we take care of the medical bills and good of it all you're alive and with ott he we basically talked about it i put forward you know like we're trying to follow these rules you guys set down to do and we try not to go the extreme way when we're doing shit and we need to bring it up to the board either so fucking get a lawyer and sue people if they say something that shouldn't be said mm. but yeah the conversation was very calm was very good he brought up that uh, um you guys were missing something from the hq some money some uh, some other stuff was uh, missing since yesterday uh, he asked if uh, if i've touched anything i said no i don't know team? if anyone uh, ott said it was like twenty-one thousand dollars, some, some um, stuff for the Mace Bank, I think. Some, um, some cards and some other shit that was gone from the HQ. Mm. Mm. Okay, so, so OTT didn't do it. If he's, uh, he was asking you about it. And yeah, he was asking me it? about it. So something was missing. Uh, I feel like we left the conversation on the good path. I said, like, you guys need to yeah. figure out what you fucking Honestly, guys want. KJ, basically. I think you, yeah. I think you, Reggie, Jaden, Dragon, Perez, for no reason why I name your names. I think you guys need to be within the inside the company house, man, in case something happens, man. This shit don't seem safe to me. Honestly. we need to start. I mean, I'll, I'll, that's crazy I'll agree that we probably need to keep some more people around yeah we need to fucking issues what KJ, the fuck I'll is be, that i'll be straightforward it seems like there's some issues right now that don't seem resolvable without potentially the <sighs> removal of an executive member well the cat's or out of the bag unless, now unless we have a full Ooh. conversation so this like because you're obviously one of the highest ranking members of the company i'm gonna tell you that straight up just so you're aware okay what Hello. i need you to do with this information is I need you to be aware and keep an eye on the house. Okay. And no one beside the two with me and Benji here really know about this, but you, aren't you literally the next, the highest rank beside us? The GM. Yeah. You're the GM, uh, right? Yeah. I got promoted you, you to the GM. To, you deserve to know this. So. Appreciate that, Ray. Means a lot coming from you. Yes. Of course, you did. Freebie! I, mean, honest, I think the response that you had towards Jen Jen was incredibly level headed, and it was exactly what I would have said. Is that uh, if I heard uh, both sides, is that she shouldn't have said what she said, and she, she shouldn't have gotten shot, though. You know, like both. Yeah. And the medical payment response was a good uh, response, and you handled that very well. So uh, I'm honestly. I, I, I tried to, you know, because uh, I understand what went down is not good. At the same time, OTT brought up it took a long time before. Apparently. He shot Jajan down, some RJ guy from the besties shot OTT down, and then it took a while before anyone acted to shoot him down or whatever. It so took, I think it took, you know, yeah. it took about 12 seconds to, uh, 12 seconds. for me to take down the guy, unfortunately. Yeah. But then, you know, no, the, the Benji, can, I, can I ask if you hesitated only because the guy on the bike, or this is a genuine question, or was it also because you are confused about the situation? I'll be honest with you, okay? And this is from legit, okay? When I pulled out the gun, I assessed the situation. Number one, what does this mean if I fucking clap the cunt in the face? And two, 
I see the cunt on the bike. That's all it is. And uh, I think that's a, I wanted it's to shoot. Fair. I wanted yeah. to shoot sooner, but he literally looped behind Paneer, and Paneer accidentally carried him. That's why this seemed slightly longer than what it was. Legit, I had one clip. I didn't miss a bullet. Put the guy down. The guy on the bike drove away. Took put OTT in the car. We bounced. The the problem <laughs> the problem is like, you hey you're th you're telling me like OTT got mad at you because of it it took so long for you to respond it just seems well here's the thing with OTT right one moment he's mad and one moment he doesn't care so <laughs> I talked to Sly and he said one thing that really triggered OTT was the fact that nobody stepped up and defended him right when something happened and then during the meeting he said. I'm not overly concerned about why nobody did anything. So it's... <laughs> I don't know what to say, man. Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah. I told, so I talked a little bit with Peter. Apparently he was there as well. And he came to me today. He's been... He's up there pushing right now. Uh, can I, can I be honest? Afraid of... Sorry, sorry, oh, sorry. sorry. There's something that's going on here. Okay. And I told this to OTT in front of everybody yesterday. The thing that he fails to realize, uh, Raymond, KJ, is that he, in, for the first time in his life, his type of manipulation and gaslighting is just not working as easily as it normally does. You get what I'm saying? Because, because, because it's between people that are in his organization. Exactly. And he's not the like, sole and leader. This, who can, and this is the shit that uh, we do too. And the difference is... It takes way longer to do it to us. And and there's just some frustration here that we're not molding to what one person actually wants. Because whether we like to admit it or not, the company needs some sort of leader, right? But because we can't elect a leader, the leadership comes in form of mentality. And right now... He's trying to give that mentality to us through very to various different manipulation, right? And maybe manipulation is a hard word to be using, man. It's just he's trying to influence us the way that secures him I mean, too. Listen, I'll just say it straight up, Benji. I, it doesn't seem like it really matters anymore because at the end of the day, what was said, what I heard you say, that's just not recoverable. Like, what I'll do you be mean? Honest. Like I don't that I'm a dick rider you, and SBSer. That you get away with shit because you're a dick rider, and and the words that went back and forth, and the constant, uh, you know, arguments that happened. What Mickey told me too. Like it's not just you that has an issue; <laughs> it's also Mickey, and now myself, who who usually I feel like it's not like I'm a, I'm the glue or some shit, but I I just don't think I can even help in this situation. I can't do anything. It's, it just seems unrecoverable. Mm. Yeah, I mean, like, there's just a lot of shit that was said, and I think it's all just out of the bag now, and people are coming to terms with what this means for the company. I feel like, I feel like there is no, there is no wrong in what OTT wants. It's the right move to make us a family, a gang. You know what I mean? Even without the label, it's the right thing to do. However, it's well, like I don't know how. This might sound harsh, bro, but I thought the company's point was to have disposable people that help us have fun. Yeah, but if those di if those disposable the... people become important, then they become part of the fucking company. Yeah. Like I, I don't know how. Like I know is that I know that's mean to say, but that was the goal, right? Like I mean, yeah. I don't know. To, supposed to be like for example, yeah. Work it was more interns at the time. We made interns disposable, and then we made them assets. Exactly. And then contract, exactly. Contractors was like a promotion that Correct. we gave to specific people. Uh, I'll I'll be honest, Benji. I mean, there's there's so many things we talked about the meetings in the past. So I don't really even need to repeat it that much. But let's just say that <clears throat> us, we we have different modes of leading. We have different modes of doing various things, of operating, whatever whatever it is. But I think the majority of us have come to terms 
that we're not the leader anymore. And I actually kind of disagree with what you said earlier, is that uh, like, I, or whatever the point maybe OTT was trying to make is that we need a leader. I don't think we do. No, no, I, I it's not about leader I, of our people. I'm, I'm saying it's the, the mentality. The, right, yeah, that there's, some, there's something that needs to unite us. You know what I mean? In, in, right. in, in the, the way we operate. So because it's not I in mean, the form of a human, it's I mean, in the form of our, we what we do. We had that. We literally had that by the council. But the problem is the council has inherent issues, like underlying issues right now that we have glossed over multiple times and that when I was around, I was able to help mediate things. But now those issues have become so real that Mickey said what he said to me today. And I'll be honest, once he said Mickey that to me. Though? Oh, oh, here we go. Mickey told uh, I'm me. I'm sorry, I am. It's okay, KJ. I'll tell you, but it's like I said, Mickey told me that he doesn't think he can carry on with the company. And and citing the main reason for that was was because of what the, the, the thing that OTT did. He says that immediate reactions of violence, especially against people that are within our organization, just doesn't make any sense. And it's just not what he stands for. And it's just not something he's comfortable carrying forward with. And I, and I asked him, like, what is something that like potentially could result in him continuing to be with the company so that that's something we should talk about and he, and he said there is a possibility so it's not all said and done it just seems like the realistic answer here coming from me who's just coming back into everything seems like we have to vote either and i'll be real and it sucks to say but either like we have a conversation with ott and we figure things out or i don't even think that's realistic anymore i don't even think we can i think the realistic thing to do to keep mickey in the company if this is true is to lay it down that things don't, aren't working. No, it has been working for a little long time. Like standing on the outside looking in, basically from from my point of view as well, you kind of like could see it. But you tried to raise the issue and tried to talk a little bit about it, but there's different way of handling stuff, and I feel like from where I'm standing is like. There's three ex-gang leaders. Two of them have switched up to become very, very like that is you two, you know? You guys kind of like dropped that life, you switched up, you went a different direction. You have Mickey, he's always been Mickey, you know, the business guy. And then you have <sighs> OTT who's keep holding a little bit on to the old times, you know, and the old ways of dealing with stuff. This has been mixed signals you know like when i talk to you guys or mickey and when i talk to ott is like there's a different approach to it but he's trying to change but at the same time you guys changed and did your thing and it takes longer time for him yeah but i don't i don't like the excuse there. i i agree with what you just said that excuse yeah. that that you know we're all ex-gang leaders and we can't like acclimate to what's going on with the company just doesn't make any sense because you can look no at literally me and i if i told mickey i feel like i'm chained but i don't give a fuck I still enjoy my time. I don't give no, a, I literally thing, don't like, care. And, and I feel like some people, I don't know why it is. They just, they, they can't change. And right now I'm sitting at the cross point where it, it, it literally is Mickey or OTT. And I'll be honest, even if we talk things out and, and they resolve that, Benji still is dissatisfied with the way that OTT is operated. And to be honest, I'm... I mean, me even being in the middle doesn't do anything. It doesn't matter. If, if both Benji and Mickey are dissatisfied with the way that OTT operates, then it doesn't, it, it will, this company will not work out. And there needs to be drastic change immediately. Because right now, yeah. I don't want to have to sit and wait to, for, for John Paul round two with my, my own home. And the fact that I'm even thinking that someone might go and take some of the shit out of there is insane. And the fact that I even have to be concerned about that as one of the leaders is just absurd. Like for me, I don't, I don't want to, I don't have to, I don't want to wake up and have to deal with that. Mm. Yeah. I just, this is your baby, you know? You guys were the first guys who was here. So it's up to you guys what you guys want to do. I think if the company is still going to be the company, you need to have a person like Mickey on top there, basically. Um, I think so. And I think like we need to try to we are different. We need to operate different. We need to think way more business meetings, you know, getting fucking lawyers involved in shit if you get into trouble. You know what I mean? 
And I feel like a lot of us have been able to switch up that and some people are holding a little bit back. But yeah, I think there's the, ultimatum. I mean, like the whole concept of everything that we done, the problem is we didn't progress past being in the South side. So people like OTT, uh, bro, kind of, we, he, we didn't move bro, north to Polito though. Actually. He, 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 OTT lives five seconds away from his old gang home, bro. You know, yeah, I mean, the energy is exactly still there. I mean, to be honest, it's not the, our fault though. You know, there's not really very many options for homes right now. And I do get your point. It's, it's just Mirror Park. I'm, I'm still waiting. Remember what we said? We were waiting for yeah. homes to uh, become available in, in, in Vinewood or uh, at least on Great Ocean Highway, but nothing's available yet. Yeah. So what what will happen now and what will go on and what do I need to do? Because I right think... now I've been coming every PM. I've been saying we just go out, we do our work, we keep it tight and we do our thing. Uh, okay. My thoughts real quick, if, if, if you don't mind real quick, Benji. My thoughts are that I don't think the company is immediately over. I think depending on the next conversation, the next board member meeting we have, who's that? It doesn't matter. The like next Andy. board meeting we... What the fuck? That's Andy. Okay, anyway. I can see their hair. Yeah, the, yeah. The, depending on the way the next board meeting happens, depending on what is said, depending on who does what, I think at, at best we're going to leave, we're going to lose a board member. And depending on which board member it is, and the way that the conversation goes, we might lose more than one board member. And at that point, it just. It's a conversation we need to have with all the PMs. Why will you lose more than one board member? Okay, do you want my take? Yeah, please. If Mickey leaves, if Mickey leaves the company, yeah, the company's over. The company they will not continue to have the initial vision that we began the company with. It will, it will just dissolve into not dissolve, right? But it will. Migrate no, the company will not be the company without Mickey. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. Maybe I'm a little bit biased here, but I, I solely believe that like he's one of the key figures for making the company, the company, what I think the company is, and how I think we should operate in the company. Yeah, that's why just, I kind of like put you know, all the fucking violence and gang behind me. Exactly. It's not just the fact that like even if he doesn't come around very often, right? He, he, like. It doesn't matter. None of that matters. What matters is that when he is around, he's almost like Tilt a, to give it a 10 like bomb earlier, brother. I appreciate you. Mm -hmm. when we're, when we're I'm, I'm just listening, you know, chat. When we, when we inherently become as bloodthirsty as we normally are, Benji, he's kind of like a check that's like, hey, like, what the fuck are you guys doing? Or he's even in the back of your mind. You know, he lives rent-free in my brain when I make my decisions nowadays. Who? Oh. Mickey. Mickey. Yeah, I mean, guys, uh, there's no hiding the fact that Mickey is the barometer that we use to be different. That That's why I, I have no problem with Mickey being the way he is. He's the idiot that twats out that he's got two guns on him. I hate that and, he did that. And he runs around. Him. He's the one that makes these events that give us a different vibe. You know what yeah. I mean? Like. For me, this is the this is the sad thing, right? It's like I value all of this, bro. And the thing is, I'm not here to I'm done with my reassurance era. I'm not here to appease OTT because just as he put it yesterday when we were having a conversation after he got shot down. He said, "It's either the board will appease Jan Jan or appease him, right? So, and I well, told him. I think I think he's missing a major point. Which is the point he's missing, is that it's not appeasing Jan Jan. It's appeasing the mentality that Mickey wants to carry forth with the company. And if you have Mickey, who is literally on the edge of leaving the company, and he, I don't think he even realizes it. That's then, my point. I told him, it's not. The thing is, for him, it's black and white, right? You choose. Jan Jan, or you choose him. But he doesn't get that. The other side is the whole fucking shit with being a company that hands out contracts. We don't, we, we, we don't, we, without the contract thing, I'm not saying this is the thing that I feel like even the staff were confused about yesterday. How if we don't do contract work, 
the company is dead. It's not dead in the sense of we don't have pharma, we don't have 20 people, and we can't operate or do a maze bank. We can. But then we lose the element that allows us to do jobs with people like fucking Dundee, Jan Jan, Suarez, Lenny Hawk, all this shit. Did you say Suarez? The yes, the, the cop. He's a contractor for yeah. us now. Why the fuck would we make a police officer a contractor? Well, you know. weren't here, buddy. Yeah. It got voted on. Uh, bro, bro, guys, uh, listen, respectfully speaking, I don't want a cop to work with the company. I mean, I, 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 I told you. He got us the money printer. Aren't you dating a cop? I'm dating a cop, but she doesn't do jobs with this. Yeah, well, no, she's she standing in front of the house when we talk. What is wrong with you guys? Well, Ray, somehow I feel like you understand. I think OTT would have a harder time understanding. That's the thing. <laughs> what? I, I, I'm, you lost me. Like I, You've genuinely lost me. What the fuck? They... Why is the cop in the company? Well, I... He's not in the company. He's, He's a, a contract contractor. hired with doing jobs. I think he joined in doing some money <laughs> bunch as a driver. And he joins in on some heist as a driver. He's not. Oh, yeah. He's not a cop contractor. anymore. He's not a cop anymore. What do you mean he's, yeah, not, he's not? Why would you not oh, believe so, oh, that? Oh, sorry, we we forgot. You are a fucking yeah, he's piece fired. Of shit. He's fired. <laughs> yeah, he's fired. Yeah. Did nobody say that? <laughs> my bad. My bad. No, my bad. No one you said that. You fucking you piece of shit. You thought he was an active cop. No, no, no. He's not. He's not a cop no more. Why did Suarez yeah, he's, he's no fired? He's only one of the best police officers. I have yep. no idea. I have no idea. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> Cause he's a W man's. I, I just brought that. So that yeah, I mean, what are we gonna do here, boys? I I don't know, man. I feel like I don't know, Ray. Maybe I'm the problem, man. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? You're right. Can I be honest with you, Ray? Yeah. What's how much do you think uh, we're all entitled to if we left? Uh, equal split. I don't even care if so, if I worked more, you worked more, or even if Mickey didn't do anything or whatever. I don't care. Uh, equal split. I'd like to give my uh, two week notice, and if I can uh, leave with twenty five percent of the company, I'd appreciate that. Wait, actually, you don't even want to have a conversation with Mickey? Yeah. I'm tired of this shit, bro. All right. Well, uh, damn. I don't even know what to say. Yeah. What the hell's your plan? I don't know. We'll see. Uh, okay. All right. Um, I suppose if we're going to do the two week notice, we should still have a meeting so that someone, I mean, you do know, you do realize what he owns the home, right? And he could technically remove our keys at any point. Yeah. I'll, I'll remove 25% of anything I see in there. Okay. Maybe we shouldn't do that. Um, what more do I need? Do I need, uh, cause I'm not trying to cause a ruckus here. I'll just take stuff and leave, man. The, do we need Mickey to sign off on this? Like to board at least? Or what do you, how does this work? I feel like we should talk to Mickey. Uh, bro, like this is a big, you need to realize what you just said, Benji. This is a really, really big decision. And there's a lot of hands at play here. Yeah. Like, we but... should have a conversation. What we're doing with the other company members. Like, I mean, KJ and everyone, like they deserve to know. Too. like like everything like what what we're doing with the operation going forward are we abandoning like who's getting the chip everything you know yeah i mean that the cards fall right what do you mean i'm sure people will make decisions along the way after they hear the news but is this beyond saving no <laughs> sorry sorry to ask Fuck, you guys fucking just promoted me to GM and now fucking everything is falling apart. 
Yeah, Benji, I, I honestly want to suggest that you, you give it a little bit of time. Like, I mean, at the very least, we do a, we do a little vote, you know? Like, KJ, you, company... you, KJ, I want you to know, I, I know you already know this, but I don't expect anything from you, brother. You stay in the company, do well, hope you become a board member, man. Motherfucker, Benji, you leave the company right now, Mickey leaves. <laughs> Mickey leaves, I leave. You think, you think everyone in yeah, the company there's wants no to... company to work for anymore. What the fuck do you mean? Like, you guys need to fucking realize the majority of the people who are here is here because of you guys. Mickey, like the board member. Like, you guys need to fucking sort out your fucking shit and call a spade for a spade and fucking do what you guys need to do. Yeah, Benji, you I... You guys know I, what you guys need to do I as agree, well. I agree with KJ here. Let's have a fucking conversation. Like, if you don't enjoy OTT being in the company, then vote him out of the company. I... As... As I, difficult as that is, just do it. It's I don't, your, your because, right as a because, board member. Because, dude, dude I, I, I don't know what to say. It's like, I don't, I genuinely don't think he's a bad guy. I told him yesterday, Ray, I wasn't going to push him out. My goal here is not to get you, KJ, Mickey. Oh, my God, let's push OTT out of this shit. I think everybody knows that OTT is not a bad guy. And that is not what it's at stake here or what we're arguing either. It's the way of visions and the way you think you see the company operate, basically. And he sees different. You guys, I would say you three see it different compared to him. How is it that I leave for two weeks and the entire fucking company falls apart, Benji? How? I made the joke be before out. I flew to Korea. I was like, oh, the company is probably going to fall apart when I'm gone. I didn't literally fucking mean it. What the fuck is that? We put so much work into everything. I got to be honest with you, Ray. It's been an underlying tone for the last, like, two months. I to know it some... has, KJ. I've, yeah. I've had my back and forth with OTT so much. And I guarantee you, because of the energy that OTT and I had towards each other, I guarantee you that kind of, like... The other board members were just kind of gliding by <laughs> the, that. You know, they were like, oh, it's just Ray and OTT duking it out. And all no, they, but you they need to take a stand the, somewhere, you know what I mean? If the yeah, company's no, not no, no, working, it's what, not what working. I'm trying, what I'm trying to say here is that I feel like I, I and OTT resolved a lot of tension by arguing. And everyone else that there was a board member saw us arguing and didn't want to deal with that. So they went into their own thing until things were more calm. Now we're coming to the realization is that is that now there's a lot of tension between all the board members because I wasn't here to fucking be that that person between everyone waking up. And now the issue is like... Bro, you know why, you know why I said what I just said, Ray? Because I'm about to be something I don't want to be, man. Because I'm starting to talk shit about OTT actively. Because I feel like he's doing it against me to win people's hearts. But I, the second I start, bro, there's no going back. He's going to look like a dickhead now. That's the problem. I keep on being nice. I keep on trying to be neutral. I keep on trying to stay facts. Yesterday, the whole fucking night when he was talking, he made it sound like he was left at the fucking shootout. Dude, he was fucking, the guy who shot him got shot and he got rescued. I don't know what the fuck else I need to do. Like, and I'm always made out to look like the bad guy. So, you know. I'm tired of trying to convince people, man. Yeah, no, I understand. That's a, that's a good take. I hate that. Like, it's just fucking shit. I, I'm not here to yeah. to fight for everyone because we can't see eye to eye about something, bro. I uh, I agree with what you just said, actually. Yeah, I don't. Once you start talking badly about someone, I mean, why why don't you just? In my opinion, if you if if you feel this way. Benji, you need, you need to take that. Right, I'm canceling the call. L listen, Benji, if you feel that way, why don't you just, like, have a vote? Like, we just vote OTT out. And you already feel like, I mean, Mickey, I, I guarantee you, Mickey agrees with you. Right? And if you have two of the board members voting someone out, I mean, I feel like I'd have to vote too, like, 100%. So, I mean, I'm just... I mean, I'll be you can, can, you I, can, I, like, can I give you an even hotter take? Sure. 
I feel like there's only like this question of what we're about to do because people are worried about losing the butt coin. I think the difference is I don't give a fuck. Like if the, if, if the keys belong to somebody else that was not OTT, I think our movement would have been different three weeks ago. And, uh, you know, like I'm, I'm not here to try and take away shit from OTT or you or, or, or Mickey. So, so I, I, I don't know, like, you know, like I don't want to, I, I'm trying to put my mind in a non hazy fucking status, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm Thank clear. You. I'm clear right now. I don't have shit. I don't need shit. I'll get friends to get shit. You know what I'm saying? This is my, this is how I feel. What I feel about the company. How I don't want this to be a competition where I'm fucking up OTT to win the favor of the people in the company. Okay. You know? Let me cut you off. Benji, I'm just going to ask you a straight up question. Be realistic. Be genuinely realistic. Okay. Is there a way that you see the company still working with you in it? And I asked Mickey that, and I genuinely feel like the only way, like with, with, with his answer, is that the OTT was gone. And you'd probably feel the same way. Now, the thing you Whoa, have to he ask, said that? You, no, I'm just insinuating that. Oh, okay. That. What the fuck? Listen, Benji, I, I need you to think about this. This is important. Because what if, if there was a vote to remove someone? I'll be honest, Benji, if you were to leave the company, you're literally the person I do everything with, right? You you and I probably run and will run 90% of the operations going forward, and it'd feel very odd to lose the other person I'm working on everything with. If Mickey were to leave, we would lose our identity and essentially the root ideals that we started with the company, the original six. And I don't want to be the asshole who says it. But if OTT were to leave, we would lose, like, our production. At <laughs> fucking hell, this right? guy is you so know? fucking cool. And I feel like there's ways that we could replace that. Now, <laughs> if you were to leave, I'd leave. If Mickey were to leave, I'd leave. If OTT were to be gone, I think I would still try a little bit more. <laughs> That's and if, so if the only way for us to carry forward is the OTT be going on, I would probably resolve to that. As rough as that is to say. Now, preferably, Fucking I would no. still like to hear OTT talk. That's just my take. Uh, and, it, and, and it sucks to say. But I, if that's the only way to keep you in the company, I don't know what to say. I don't think there's any talking to OTT anymore. For me, at least. I'm sorry. Like, I'd be willing to jump into a board meeting, but I have no more words to say to him. Like, I, I'm, I'm done with my convincing. There's nothing to convince no more. He can, he can, he can, he can say everything he wants to me. I listen, but they, that shit don't mean shit to me now. Because after all the fucking mental gymnastics that I've tried to fucking figure out how... I've brought zero fucking conflict to our doorstep for, for somebody who is literally the pivot that always puts us into shit to call me a fucking dick rider. Dude, you're, that's jokes, bro. That's just jokes. So that's in his mind. He thinks that his inability is literally simply because he's just better than me. And I'm not here to convince him to be otherwise, bro. If he thinks that he can feel, hey, bro, I told him, dick rider? Motherfucker, you joined the company to be a dick rider, bro. All he said to us, remember on top of the building, Raymond? What did he say? I just want a shot. I just want a chance to be with y'all, bro. Yeah, I don't care. If, uh, yeah, well, there you go, man. Shit. Yeah, he, he, was pouring his, he was pouring his heart out when it was me, you, what, uh, you know, uh, Mickey, uh, X, and Marty. He was pouring his heart out, saying, I just want a shot. I mean, he stuck with it, but... 
Yeah. Yeah, well, it is what it is, okay. man. <laughs> I feels bad from my... You know what's interesting to me, Benji? What? Is that I felt, I thought the only issues in the company were between me and OTT. You know, I thought the... Remember we had this conversation a few weeks back that it was just me and OTT arguing all the time. Yeah. So to hear you guys now arguing with OTT, <laughs> it honestly makes me laugh a little bit, but I do feel like uh, almost bad for the guy. I mean, didn't didn't we have a vote way back when on that rooftop whether or not we should uh, we should have him as the seventh person and like there was a talk about that. I just don't remember how that went. I, I don't even fucking remember, bro. Uh, 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 I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do, bro. Yeah, you, you're telling me, motherfucker. What, what, bro? Here's the thing, Benji. Here's the thing. What the fuck happens to all the other operations? They operate, man. What on their own? I mean, they could. Bro, there's so many people in the company. Okay. I... You know how I feel now? I've said what I wanted. I'm not gonna just leave you in the lurch. Let's, uh... Let's sort out who goes what, where goes what. You know what I'm saying? And yeah, then I'll I think say goodbye. I... We'll make sure the people that are in the company get sorted out. If they stay, if there's something to stay for, if they want to go with somebody else, if they want to do something else, I think we all decide that now. <clears throat> okay, we need to speak to Mickey. Straightforward, we need to talk, we need to, talk to Mickey. Okay, where is Mickey? Like, I don't fucking know. Is it gonna be a third day of this? No, it's this is this is for real now. Oh shit, bro. Okay, I'm gonna meditate for a second, Benji. All right, one sec. Go ahead, man. Yo. Ain't this some shit, KJ, huh? Yeah, this is actually crazy. And like, this is deeper than I thought, you know? <laughs> I wonder who took that shit from the house, though. What the fuck? I don't know. Peter has been trying to call me, so try to yeah, call Yeah, that's right, bro. Bro, where the fuck are the people right now, man? Shit. I need them awake, bro. J. 
just I'm just like I thought someone took fucking everything out of the house because of this <laughs> you know, it's, Right, and she, <laughs> bro, bro, I shit you not, Benji. I, I open the fucking door and everything is gone. As if you just purchased the house. I thought someone actually yoked everything. Well, you got everything covered bro. over there? Dragon's in the house decorating, so yeah. All right, tell Dragon to call me. I can call Benji. Thank you. Thank you. All right. I got penis here. Dragon? What's it? What's good, Ben? Okay, be uh ah! There's some developments and I need you to be ready as you always are. Maybe what? I need you to be ready. As you uh... as you always are. Ahem! Okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Quick question, right? Mm, mm. What do you mean by development? You know what I mean. Okay, so so hold on. Let, let me ask. You, let me ask you this: Is Ray and Mickey coming along? You know, I like Ray and Mickey. You know what, Jerry? I'll talk to you later. But just be ready. Yeah. Yeah. Just let me know. Yeah. Is Reggie around? Uh, I don't know. He stayed awake for a long time. He's oh, uh, about this. I think someone called he's been me. farming. They bought another house, you know, and they doing the f getting all the fucking shit they need, you know, for the moonshine. Yo, what's up, Ernest? Can you uh? Need to talk what, you, to what is your plan then, like? What do you think my plan is? I don't know what your plan is. I don't know. Plan is know. what you it's always. You can just, just go out there and be Benji. You know what I mean? That is that is the thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. What about Mickey though? Like Mickey is like oh, done. He's Mickey, like over Mickey. This shit. Mickey will be fine. I, I'm going to take care of Mickey no matter what. We gotta worry about that, man. Whatever I, whatever, whatever I end up doing, I'm gonna make sure I do stuff with Mickey no matter what. KJ. All right. You're gonna be fine, brother. Okay, you do what you need to do, man. No, I know I'm gonna be fine. I have no issue with that. I'm a hardworking man, you know. I know I can find my way, you know, around Los Santos, but I strongly believe in this, you know what I mean? Like when you and Mickey talked to me, you know, when I came into the shit, you know what I mean? This is something new, something different, you know? Like we're not like ninety percent of the other fucking people in Los Santos going around robbing people on the daily and laughing around, you know? No, for sure. Kind of like done with that life, you know, moving on to this shit and try to make it work. Follow your vision, you know, make his vision, raise the vision. Be different. It seems to me like people just give up on it, you know, because there is some issue. I understand this is not like just some issue. This is a big issue, but. It's been brewing for a long time. Yeah, it has been. I mean, we're probably going to have a board one, talk soon, man. You know, I'm just... One thing I know, we're not quitters, though. Like, we never quit. We we always work the uphill battle. We've always been like that. I'm not trying to, I'm not trying to take away anything from anybody, you know? I'm just making sure that... No, no, no. I, I, I know, know that. I know that. You, you've always been that guy, you know? Like, I, I know who you are. Just gotta make sure things don't get taken away from me, you know? Yeah, but at the same time, you're looking out for everybody else as well. Because that is who you are. Mm -hmm. Even though if they're 
talking shit about you or whatever, they always look out so they make sure they get their shit as well. Correct, correct, man. I know that. That's why I feel like it's it's a little bit sad, you know? Because I think like we can make this shit work. But then there need to be some... Need to take some hard fucking decisions to make it work. Very hard. I'm about to say some crazy shit, bro. About what? I I think uh, there's gonna be some deep talks coming soon, bro. Maybe that's what's needed, you know. Everybody's been holding back a little bit, you know, when it comes to everything. Like fucking put it on the table, and we need to fucking move on and make sure you know everything is stable, but gonna be honest with you if you if you leave this shit you know like if mickey is no longer here what the fuck is here to you know work for oh you you know he can join mickey right no matter what he does what what is he doing though if he if he's done with the company i guess he would just want to go out there and do his own thing yeah hey, bro i can i can talk to mickey man he legit like like i just tell him that you're interested in like working with him for good like he'll do it bro what are you doing then? What do you mean? I'm I'm just gonna do what I normally do, bro. Just you know, just lounge around, do nothing, you know, Benji stuff, you know what I mean? Shut the fuck up, man. <laughs> Everybody thinks you're doing nothing, but you're always doing something because you're always thinking through what the fuck you're doing. Come on. Do I do I, I think you. things through? I don't know. Yeah, you do. I do? Interesting, man. It looks like everybody thinks that you're doing nothing, but you're not. Mm -hmm. That is their downfall because they think that. <laughs> fuck this guy, bro. Ray. You think? <clears throat> um, I think uh, I'm I'm concerned right now, bro. Ray, I, I like legit. Why, I just I just thought about something important, bro. Watch what do you this, think about? Get off the phone. I need to talk to you properly. Come on. I don't want you to, like accidentally okay. repeating that in front of her. Uh, can I? Should I call this person here or no? Who is that? Perez. No, he needs to stay there. Okay, you need to stay at the house, Perez. Listen, All right, goodbye. I just I realized go. something, bro. Okay. What'd you say? Ray. It's about to be some crazy shit, chat. Watch out. <clears throat> I just fucking realized something. What? If somebody is taking shit from the house, what if somebody's already trying to steal shit and it's not safe? We got to move everything out. We got to move everything out right now and we got to make sure that we decide what to do with all the shit after the board meeting. Right? Dude, like it's not saying what, who the fuck took all this shit? It's not safe in the bro. It could be anybody. So many people have access to the house now. If you think about it. I don't, I don't know who has access. You know, listen. Bro, what do you mean? No, all this? the PMs do. Okay, listen, listen, listen. Dragon is watching the house right now. Let me just call him and tell Doesn't him. Doesn't matter, sure bro. What the fuck if it's OTT taking that shit? Okay, I get you. All you gotta do is wake up, take a name off the goddamn panel. You're done. I know. Bro, I don't feel safe but, no more, man. You got, bro, we, you gotta do something about that, bro. Listen, I, I mean, what can I do? If I can tell him to sell the house, bro. No, listen, move Benji, that shit Benji. inside the house right now. Dragon, this is important. You probably heard from Perez that I need people watching the house like 24-7, right? Bro, bro, just move everything to the asset house okay. for now. I ain't kidding. Okay, listen. Dragon, supposedly someone is moving shit out of the house. You know about this? Okay, you know? Do you know who it is? Oh, fuck, Dragon.
think I should uh, move shit from the, um, the pharma house as well. Benji? What's up? You want me to move shit from the pharma house? Yes, KJ. It's time to lock it down, brother. Lock it down. Oh, man. I didn't want to do this, man. I didn't want to do this, bro. They keep trying to fuck with me. We'll see, Dragon, okay? We'll see. I, 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 we, we do need hands on deck because we need to make sure. I need Reggie. I need him to lock down Anita. Who has access to that right now in the fudge house? It's me, Reggie, Jaden, and Mike. Okay. How how heavy do we trust Mike? Because I I'm not 100% on him. Okay. Uh, not 100. Can never be 100. You take him out for now? Yeah. Actually, no, we need, we, yeah, we need to clear everything right now. Nobody but you and, and Reggie. Mickey's awake. Also, okay. Benji, can we? Okay. Can we talk? Come here. What's up? Mickey, we need to talk. It's not good. A lot has changed in the. Yes, like a lot. Like, like we need to talk at the soccer park. Do you know what it is in the mirror park? Football field. The football field. I'll tell KJ to go get you at the house. KJ, can you pick up Mickey at the house and bring him here? Thank you. What's up? Benji? What's wrong? Do you know where the stuff in the house is? No. Why? Be honest with me. Do you know? I told like there's you. No reason for you There's no reason for you to lie to me I Benji. told me. you surely you're gonna find out soon I mean I found out So you do know Of course I fucking know So why wouldn't you fucking tell me Because I don't want you to get blamed for the shit I'm about to do What are you about to do I'm about to get them to move out Everything and lock down every house I'm not going to get held hostage to people who have fucking keys to someplace, man. So we're going to fucking take everything, hold it, and then we have the meeting. Then we can talk with our balls hanging because nobody's worried that shit might get stolen because of butt coin. Okay, but why are you not involved me into that, you know? Because you, you just woke up, motherfucker! Okay. All right. Whatever it is. I, I I mean, I could tell you were being fucking sarcastic the whole time when I was asking you. So yeah, of course. I'm not trying to hide that from you, Ray. Like, obviously. No, no I could tell. Yeah. I just didn't want to, like, fucking straight up say, bro, we're snaking something right now, bro. Like, what the fuck? No, I get you. Dragon is um at the house right now. He has the money and everything like that. Yeah, I know. Okay, so you, you are under the interpretation that we should move everything out of the home. Absolutely. And then the Absolutely. And yes. Then because it's I was just using Dragon's of, move yesterday yeah. as premise to justify why we're doing it. But then now the cat's out of the bag. Yeah. I think we should just okay. move everything so we can have a fair discussion where we ain't afraid of uh, losing valuables. That's it. Okay. All right. 
think he's about to be here. Okay. Benji, what what do you think about the rest of the company? About the rest of the company? <clears throat> I have no problem with them, but uh, loyalties no, are going to be think? seen. Like, what do you think is going to happen with them going forward? Mm, I don't know. Isn't that more on you guys? No, motherfucker. Like, I don't <laughs> think the company's going to last. To be honest. I think it's just... It's about... The, bro, like, the concepts need to be... I think we never never sat down properly and tried to organize our thoughts, bro. Because everything that we've done is is not... Like, we all kind of know it, but we didn't do it. You know what I'm saying? And, and the fundamental issues are there, bro. Like, if this was a one time zone group, it'd be different too. Uh, do you guys want privacy? No, no, no. You're good to be here. Mickey, uh, a lot has changed in the, like, like two hours that we haven't spoken. Tell me, gentlemen. Benji, it's you. Take the floor. Um, you already know what happened, Mickey. I think, um, a lot of the shit that happened yesterday is just, I know it was unfortunate. I, I, you know, I hate that it's the, the thing that breaks us or the, uh, you know, turning point, but it is what it is. I think it was coming sooner or later. doesn't really matter what the situation is, but I, I just don't see us, uh, being able to move forward with somebody like me just constantly, you know, butting heads with somebody else. And I'm just tired of like having to defend myself and not shit talk somebody else, defend my honor. There's a lot of shit, bro. Just, uh, I just don't want to do it no more. So I told Ray that I like to put in my two weeks notice and uh, bow out from the company. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, 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 whoa. Pause, 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 pause. Mm. You want to bow out? Yeah, I do want to bow out because I just can't. Like... I wanted to bow out. Nah, man, you should. Like, if you think you can stay, you should stay, bro. Wait, 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 wait. Gentlemen, my my issue has been this, and it's something that me and Breckers, I'll be honest with you, have privately discussed before. Really? Yes. My issue has been our response to to conflict and oh God. escalation of things. The fact that we resort to violence in certain situations. When I say we, though, I mean lion's share of that being Mr. Tyrone. If everyone's issue is Mr. Tyrone, why the fuck do we not just vote him out and then you guys stay in the company? Because it's too hard to do, bro. You 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 realize like I do I do mean what I said. Like I'm not I'm not kidding. Like he can be the company alone for all I give a fuck. But like the way the way he wants to treat everybody is an honorable thing. But just not the concept that I can even be bothered arguing about anymore. Everything, everything that he wants, the way people, the way he wants people to think, it's it's clear, bro. You, you get what I'm saying? Like like people arguing. Oh my God, it's not a gang. Even Maxine was trying to say, stop, you know, stop bringing up that it's a gang. Don't don't dogpile on blah blah blah. But the mentality, the principle, it is. They want they want it to be like a gang. The fuck. Well, that's rich coming from you, Mr. Ramos. I heard. Mm -hmm. You know what? It is rich coming from you. See, I'm the one who actually has the one. Because you Tell also have been doing this. Oh, really? Oh, really, Benji? But what the fuck did I do? What the fuck did I do? I was told you ocean dumped someone yesterday. We don't ocean dump people. Oh, my God. Dumb fuck. Listen. Paneer called me. There was a dead homeless man in his car. 
Dead, dead. What do you want me to tell the cunt? Wait, Take wait, him to wait, the wait, fucking wait, cops! Wait. wait. Take wait. him to the hospital! 